Here's the score. Yes, it is. We're done first today. Oh. So it is Island 11 that win the toss. Jared Wilson says that he wants to bowl first. First ball up in the air and gone. They got a wicket. First ball, Mohamed Baba. Well, he's uh, sort of poor form con considering the sort of batter he is. Continues. He goes for a first baller. Hits his sky up in the air. The catch has been taken. And that's Michael Riley who makes no mistakes at all. So first blood, it is to Ireland. What a start this is for them. Absolutely brilliant. O'Reilly bowling well here at the moment. Oh, that's a good ball, but it's been hit up in the air. It's another opportunity and been taken. Here's another one that goes, and Ishan goes for a three ball duck. It's another one. And it's, uh, well, the catching has always been superb from Ireland. Got the word. Went for the Yorker. Well, this time, well, that's the old Chinese cut. It was a much better delivery. But uh, the, the Prince gets a little bit of something on this. And that race is away for four runs. This one's short, and this is actually punched over backward point for six. Maximo! Well, Prince Tamani got a bit lucky with that inside edge that went for four, but there's nothing lucky about this. He uses the pace of Wilson, and he knocks that one over the fence. That's the first Maximo of the day, and it won't be the last free cut. So effectively, he is here, really, isn't he? He cracks this one. This is four. Oh. Really good shot, and this is a proper shot, really. That one is going to race into the ice cube. Goes after this, turns it around the oh. corner, beats the field. That was an awkward bounce for Matt Humphreys. This is going to go to the boundary. Four runs, Quattro Canelas Mas. Prince is on a heater at the moment. He's 21 off nine. Chance taken out. Well, he'd be unfortunate. When he played this shot earlier, he played it all along the ground and he got the reward. Four runs. This time he's gone aerial. Doesn't really get too much power in it. Doesn't get the height as well to get it over the man in the circle. And that's a, that's a soft dismissal for the Prince. Fair enough. It's his first ball he's faced. Up in the air. Though, yeah, Opportunity. Could, yeah, Burton's not going to drop this. He gets there and he cat takes the catch. And Chris Minos Mills just never got going. Well, it's hit out or get out, really. And he has, does the ladder, tries the former. And yeah, the captain just wasn't his day at the crease. Came in at four. He ends up going for one of six. And spin to win. Humphreys gets a wicket. I think he's had a really good series so far as well. Spain lose another wicket. That's four down now. It's 26 for four. I bet there's a bit of an e chance gone, caught and bold. No power in the shot at all, and that's nice to done. So Hamza Salim, he has to depart as well, just for one or four deliveries. And this spin attack continues. Carson McCulloch, caught and bold. Well done, sir. Anyway, it's in the air. It's going to go over the infield. It's going to be four. Cuatro Caderas. Quicker one. This one's through the gap, and this will be four. Nice shot. Govinda uses the pace this time. Goes for this, and he's going to pump it out of the ground. Maximo! DDC. He's the ticket out of here for Spain. And he bangs that one over long on for six. Shot, full runs, and that is class once again. We're going to have a good time. As we see, DDC having a good time. He nails this. Well, that one smashes the flag. Maximo! Back to pace, and it's DDC putting the pace on the ball. He sends Wilson the journey. Good shot, six runs. Oh, he's, he's, he's having a good day. <laughs> this is big. This is going to go up to the bar and it's, order Vic it's going to order a Victoria Savanza. That's a maximo. Well, Corey likes that one. And uh, I think Spain like it too, trying to get themselves out of a bit of a hole that they've dug for themselves this morning. But Dor Kayet, that was pure and that swings them into the 70s. And it starts with Govinda, who's going to loft this one out of the ground. Maximo. Oh. Well, he's going to be gone here. To be honest, they're a bit lucky here because they had no outfielder there. If Dor Kayak gets more on that, it's going to the boundary or over. But, yeah, it just gets a bit cute, and he doesn't get it in the middle. So that's a big wicket, to be honest, in the context of this game. Gets across, gets a slower ball. This is going to be out as well. It's going to be a simple catch for Seamus Lynch. So similar dismissal, and that's clever bowling, really. O'Reilly knows the new batter can be a bit jumpy there, so he bowls him a slower ball. And in the end, he's kind of beaten in the flight. I know it sounds strange to say that, but Asjad just tries to turn around the corner. He's going to go for a golden. Suddenly, O'Reilly's on a hat trick. Well, this is hit hard, and we've got a hat trick. We got a hat trick on day three, and it's also a five wicket haul. Will Mike O'Reilly take a bow? 
And Cameron, he goes for it. Of course, he was always going to do that. It was a brilliant catch out there on the deep wicket boundary. So what a moment for the young man. Five wickets and a hat trick in the ECC. And, I, and uh, Spain kind of falling apart the ninth over here. It's the end of it now, 83 for eight. Slower delivery, and it's not a good one. It gets through the gap. There's four runs, four valuable runs. Goes for this, and again, doesn't quite get it. And that kind of sums it up, really, for me, Groovin did this innings. Just couldn't get his timing going, and that personified it, really. He's the ninth bit wicket to go now. Spain with the ball remaining there, 87 for nine. Last right. ball of the innings, Catherwood. Seatbelt's on. Oh, he goes to reverse. Oh, I didn't see that coming. Now yeah. they'll probably try a run. Well, he's not going to win this race, too, that much. Latif Muhammad. Goes for the Hollywood shot, and uh, in the end, he's uh, not going to get anywhere near it. So look, in the end, Spain get scuttled for 87. Hello, cricket lovers, and welcome back. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're tuning in from around the globe. Welcome to you, our global cricket family, and welcome to the Dream 11 European Cricket Championship. Yes, it is the Euros of Cricket 21 International Nations. And this is no run. The pro comes in. You see that uh, Mohamed Ishan is back behind the stumps. Short, hit, hard, goes the distance, six runs, bowling, bowling, bowling. And it will go the distance, bowling, 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 boom. Babart's bowl the second, and he gets taken down, he gets taken out of the ground, Maximo. Well, Lynch, he is a unit, I tell you that much. He comes out there. I was a little bit surprised he's one of three. He doesn't stay that way. He gets six runs for Ireland. And he's going to get another gift here. And this is going to be out of the ground as well. Maximo. Right. This one's whipped away. This will be a task for the field. And he flies and he bats it to his teammate. Well, that's a brilliant stop from Daniel Dorkaya. Not only has he been brilliant with the bat, but that was an amazing stop. Full toss again, adios Palota, can't bowl there, Baba gets it wrong, and once again we see the Irish openers taking full toll on the bad ball, six more, and they are flying in this power play. Right, goes after it again, this time it's going to be four, again, Baba just gets a little bit straight, and this over's gone magical now, it's also the end of the second, and Iron Levin making this target look tiny at the moment, it's 40 for no loss after two. Three and four, obviously Czech Republic get to win a game. Now this is in the air and it's really high. Well, who wants this? Torquea wants it, no he doesn't, it's been dropped. Oh. Well, that was just so, so high. Tom Vine at the end, I think it was a late decision it was. from Torquea to pull out and Tom really hadn't done the preparation and that one goes down and you just can't afford to drop these openers, Rico. Yeah. Well, oh, this no. is gonna be four, probably buys. Short takes it on, and this is going to be four. So they do bring up the 50 in the power play now. 51 without loss. Last ball for Cameron. He's going for 24, and he's going to go for more because this is beautifully struck away. That's into the jungle. Maximo! Lynch is beast. I tell you that much. He moves to 25, and Iron Levin might have to fall over to lose, really, from here. 57 without loss after the power play. Goes after this, but he hasn't got all of it. It's going to be a bit of a teaser for the fielder, and it's been dropped. Well, that sums it up, really. Prince Demand took one of the all-time great catches on day one. This one, I'm not going to say it's easy, but it certainly is one that you catch it's nine one. times out of ten, really. Especially Prince Demand, who's a pretty good fielder. And he gets banged. He gets banged long. Oh, that's a shot, isn't it? Maximo! There's a slow ball. This is going to be... Over the field at Maximo Lynch. Oh, this is the thing. You can have fielders back, but when the batters are confident, they don't care. And he hits that straight over his head, even though it's deep cover. Six runs. And well, this has been thumped. It's six more. This is big. And they're making this look very, very easy. We know these two batters are dangerous. And uh, we know that they can take the game away from any team when they get game he does go for it, and he's going to get it. Bowl! 
bolle, bolle. Brrr, and that is the 50 for Lynch. Absolutely brilliant batting from Chambers Lynch. Gets to his 50 of just 16 deliveries. And this is going to be game, set, match. And it's all over. Maximo Lynch, 56 of 17. Finishes with a bang. And that was a very comprehensive performance from the Irish. I mean, this is tournament play cricket, isn't it?